You already know your boy got a fresh cut, man. Yes. <laughs> this thing's clean as fuck, boy. Your boy is sexy, man. What's good, people? What's good people, welcome back to a brand new video on my channel. Today I'm gonna be teaching you guys how to make those crazy samples like Palace or Q-Beats or something like that. So I have here this mallet flux from Contact and I'm going to choose this marimba preset. It sounds like this and I'm going to make a dark melody in uh, A sharp minor. So let's get straight into this. I like this melody, let's copy this over and make it different on the single part, so... So now let's play with the velocities and I want to lower these bass notes a little bit. And let's uh, randomize the velocities of the chords so, and the panning as well. And let's randomize these top notes as well. And let's strum these notes here. I really like that let's add some more melodies on top of this so in the last video I discovered this preset called Shemis or I don't know how you say that but let's use it in this beat that sounds cool let's add a lot of reverb to this sound so i want to put it like in the background sort of texture or something like that so let's open up for hollow vintage reverb and i'm going to use this random space mod and let's check out some of the frequencies if that's too much reverb let's choose a different mode Okay, now I want to open a contact and search for a good flute. Thank 
So I found this Irish Traverse Flute preset and I made this simple melody which fits perfectly to this sample and this is how it sounds with the melodies. So now let's add some uh, effects to these melodies. Let's add some RC20 to this um, uh, to this marimba. Let's add some isotope final to this flute. So let's set it to. 1970 year rpm set to 45 and let's play with the warp depth a little bit So now I want to add a violin a sort of texture so I'm going to open up uh, Asterix Orchestra Okay, this is perfect. This preset is called Violin Special and just play with the attack time and release time a little bit and now I wanna add some effects. First off I'm gonna EQ out some of the frequencies. And let's open up a low filter. And finally let's add some reverb. And last but not least, let's add some pan man. Now let's record this sample to Edison and let's try it in a different key or something like that. So, so now that you have this sample in the playlist, let's play with the pitch, see if it sounds any better in, in a different key. So let's lower the pitch down three semitones. Okay, that's far. Let's try pitching it up to semitone. Let's see how that sounds. I prefer my sample pitch down, but this is too good, bro. And yeah, that is pretty much it. That's all you have to do to make a far Q-beat sample or palace or something like that. So thank you so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed, make sure to drop a like on this one. Subscribe to my YouTube channel, leave a like. Follow me on Instagram, subscribe to my YouTube channel, and I'm gonna see you in the next one.